community has a peeping Tom watching their children, and there's at least two videos of what parents say is the suspect caught in the act. CBS 2's Rachel Kim has them. He was there about 45 minutes looking through the fence, taking pictures, we think very comfortable walking around her driveway. Melanie Robbins is talking about this man who she and others believe is a peeping Tom in their East Pasadena neighborhood. Robbins says in early September he was caught on camera on her neighbor's property looking through the fence into her 12 year old daughter's bedroom. He was peering through the slats so from their side you could completely look it and see her laying in her bed. I was scared, devastated, I you know. It was very emotional. I didn't want her to be alone. We didn't let her sleep in her room after that. Robbins soon began hearing of other similar incidents in the community. Then late last week, her friend told her possibly the same man was caught on camera doing the same thing at her home. When her friend saw what was going on, the man ran away. She was very disturbed, very upset. Her oldest daughter that it had happened to just uh, was 19. She just graduated high school. Robbins and her friend have filed police reports, but Robbins tells us there are at least three other incidents in addition to theirs in the last two months. There's lots of children in our neighborhood, and I'm just very concerned for someone because at that time he didn't go into anyone's room, but, you know, who knows if he gets braver and does. This concerned mother wants parents of daughters to be vigilant. Robbins says he has a distinct walk, wears gloves, a ski mask, and the same hoodie. She also tells us the suspect is hitting homes where he knows children live. It just so happens that all the children were honor roll, principal's honor roll students, and they had last, a uh, couple weeks ago, put honor roll signs out in our yard. So if I mean, we'd like him to be caught. Pasadena police say detectives are investigating and looking into whether the same suspect is involved in these incidents. If you have any information that can help, please call Pasadena police. Reporting from Pasadena, Rachel Kim, CBS 2 News.